Hi, I just wanted to take some time here to look at a door I'm, I'm installing, in the process of installing. And I wanted to make and point out how I let these uh, exterior trim pieces go and extend beyond the subfloor. I learned this out of an old uh, carpentry book. And this way, the water that gets on the casing, the metal casing, once it's capped with aluminum, continues down and it lands on the step. At least it's not stopping here and getting in behind. These are always a problem, especially with no storm uh, door here to shed the water beyond. It, but it doesn't matter even with a storm. When this trim here stops, um, even at the subfloor, like most of these doors come with, they all come with uh, the trim, the exterior trim, the brick molding stopping, even with the subfloor. It's no good. You have to either make a little extension here and extend the brick molding. In this case here, I got a piece of uh, five quarter by three and a half approximately, and that's going to get a, uh, a molded brake buddy, you know, a PVC aluminum trim that's going to get on here when it's done. But um, I just wanted to make a, a, a talk about that for a second because a lot of these doors, you know, there's always a job here where. You get on these jobs and it's a little rotted inside. Well, then it's usually a little bit rotted more inside. And then, you know, you're, they usually have tile. This is like a mudroom opening in this house. And it, it did have some damage. I was able to fix most of it. Some of it's just going to have to get left undone because it's that's the, the kind of the nature of the job here. Anyway, let me sh point out some other uh, thing I wanted to show you here. Here's just another quick example. You see how this casing stops even with the subfloor. That's uh, basically that's a, a problem waiting to happen. That keeps guys like me in business. The problem with it is there's normally tile floors in these kind of places, and that's a you know that adds up to a lot of money, and it's just an expense. So if you do these kind of jobs, even with like a, this is like a French door, I guess, uh, an Anderson, you still want to let these casings extend all the way down to the bottom. Don't terminate them here. Make them go longer and make that water keep traveling and keep going down. All right, thanks for stopping by.